This is BTV. We all know or knew someone with cancer. And chances are we also know someone whose prognosis would be better had their cancer been detected earlier. Well, that's where Verison Technology comes in. This Vancouver-based biomedical company has a new device that shows serious promise in the early detection of skin cancer. Medical journals and the market are taking notice. I think that there's going to be a huge demand for it because it's basically an unserviced market. That's Verison Technologies President and CEO Thomas Braun. In just 18 months, he and his team took a clinical prototype developed by the BC Cancer Agency and UBC's Department of Dermatology into a commercial product already approved in 27 countries, including Canada, Australia and the European Union. Verisant Aura is a unique multi-modality imaging and spectroscopy system designed to aid in the early detection of skin cancer. It scans for 21 different cancer spectral markers in less than one second, providing immediate results with 99% accuracy. Wonderful, that's great. Congratulations. It works by analyzing the chemical composition of the suspicious lesion and it tells the doctor whether or not they should do a biopsy. The need for early detection of skin cancer is enormous. In the United States, one person dies every hour of melanoma. In Canada, about one in six people will get skin cancer during their lifetime. Healthcare costs for skin cancer are almost equally shocking. In Canada alone, the annual cost of treatment is around $600 million. With an aging population, that may soon reach a billion dollars each and every year. The Verisant Aura is currently being beta tested by cosmetic and clinical dermatologists to help them make better diagnoses. The way I understand a machine like this is it picks up the song a lesion is singing. It literally picks it up and translates it into notes. So it can give us with 99% accuracy whether it's one of those lesions. But also it can compare it against precancers or non-cancers. So it can say this is not a cancer and that helps us out too. Because then we don't have to do biopsies on the lesions we don't want to. It really is a good thing for our patients. It really is a scientific breakthrough. The nice thing about our technology is that it fits right into the current practice guidelines and the current practice flow. So it's a huge help to doctors without actually trying to change things too much at once. It's painless, it's very easy to use and you don't necessarily need to go through a very um, large learning process. It's, it's very quick and easy to uh, become accustomed to the way this device works. It offers a lot of potential and a lot of excitement to a dermatologist practice. With dermatologists already lined up to buy the equipment, Verisant has completed all the necessary license and regulatory requirements for sales in Canada. The company has also signed a distribution agreement with Clarion Medical Technologies, Canada's leading distributor of dermatology products. This arrangement guarantees Verisant immediate sales revenue. The cart that holds the Aura's electronic components is manufactured in Victoria, B.C. by Starfish Medical. Starfish specializes in developing and prototyping different types of devices for a wide variety of medical disciplines. We're pleased to be working with Verisant on the Aura. I think it could have a big impact on cancer diagnostics and the fact that it's a sophisticated instrument is a great match for our core expertise. I'm very excited about what the impact this could have. Manufacturing the spectrometer and assembling the Aura is done at Verisant's ISO certified facility in Richmond, BC. It's part of our quality control system basically. Then we can be sure that this device is ready for the market and we'll start selling it very early on in 2013. Canadian certification also opens the doors to the European market. In Canada you've got 500 dermatologists but in Europe 
you've got 21,000. Some countries, including sunny Brazil, Mexico, and Australia, recognize Health Canada or European approvals. And soon, Verisant plans to begin their American FDA approval process. Medical journals are already interested. Their technology was voted by Popular Science as one of the best of what's new. Verisant technology caught our attention because it is a pick of the street on the TSX Venture Exchange. It was ranked as the number one science and technology company on the TSX Venture. The fact that they had gotten approvals around the world was compelling to us. They're working on an FDA approval, but they've already got a Canadian approval. It's obviously a game changer and we love disruptive technologies like that. The Aura is the first of Verisant's extensive okay. product pipeline. The Core is another. We actually do have a whole pipeline of products based on this platform technology. So the same device basically, but with a very small probe that goes down the biopsy channel of a bronchoscope is used to detect lung cancer. We had 96% sensitivity, 91% specificity in our pilot study that was done at Vancouver General Hospital. And those are stellar results which make the Verisant Core a best-in-class device. For general practitioners and dentists, Verisant is also working on a new technology for skin and oral cancers called multispectral imaging. But today, it's all about the aura. It is very satisfying to actually see the finished device and we've done it in about 18 months. So, you know, this really is uh, almost unique in a way in that we've done it so quickly and with comparatively so little money. And, you know, to actually produce something that's being manufactured, which is tangible, that you can hold in your hand, that'll be used in offices, that'll generate income, it's really fantastic because it's, it's what business is supposed to be about. Verisant's plans include having the Aura device in your dermatologist's office by next year, with approval for their lung and colon cancer detection device in the near future. And those are just two of several technologies Verisant is working on in the fight to find cancer in its early stages.